Hi, this is Mato. In this video, I will show you a game between Alexander Lechin and Bettinga. This is a game from a simul that Alechin played in Washington, D.C. in 1933. Alechin played on 29 boards, and in this game he had white pieces. He started with e4. Bettinga played knight to f6. Playing Alechin defense against Alechin. What would Alechin do against his own defense? Hmm? E5, attacking the knight, is the standard move. Alechin played knight to c3, defending the pawn. d5, e takes on d5, knight takes on d5. Knight to f3, bishop to g4, h3, bishop to h5, and Alechin played knight to e4. d4, bishop to c4, and bishop to e2 are the three most popular moves nowadays. Alechin played knight to e4, e6, knight to g3, bishop to g6, a3, c6, d4, queen to c7. Perhaps better was bishop to d6, and if knight comes to e5, bishop takes knight. Queen to c7, knight to e5, knight to d7, challenging the knight on e5. Knight takes bishop, and Bettinger captured towards the center. c4, attacking the knight. Knight from 5 to b6, bishop to e2, and Bettinger played bishop to e7. Well, he wanted to play bishop to d6 and then like c5. After bishop takes on g3, c takes on b6. This position was not to his liking. So he played bishop to e7. b3, defending the pawn on c4, intending bishop to f3. Knight to f6, bishop to f3. Rook to d8, lining the rook with white queen. Not rushing with castling. After 15 moves, Bettinger is holding his ground against Alexander Lehin. Can he keep it up? For how long? Bishop to b2, c5, another good move from Bettinger. Alehin castled kingside. At this stage, Bettinger was very excited because he was doing really well. Can he control his nerves? He played bishop to d6. Well, the obvious one is pretty good. c takes on d4. And probably Alehim would play something like rook to e1, not bishop takes on d4, because this is losing against bishop to c5. Okay. Bishop to d6 was played. d takes on c5. Well, this is not the best move. The best move would be knight to e2. Alehin made a mistake here. d takes on c5. And we have reached the most critical position of the game. Black to move. What would you do? Would you play bishop takes pawn on c5, bishop takes knight on g3, or something else? Please pause the video and find the best move for black. Bettinger played bishop takes on c5. Discovered attack on the queen. Missing the strongest continuation. Bishop takes on g3. That is why I said knight to e2 is a better move. And now, if c takes on b6, bishop takes on f2, check. Rook takes bishop. Rook takes queen, check. Black is winning. And what else? If king takes on f2, then queen takes on b6, check. 
black is winning again. So probably after bishop takes on g3, white will have to play something like queen to e1. But black is still better. Bishop to h2 check, king to h1, knight from b to d7. Black is better. Sadly, Bettinger missed the strongest continuation and played bishop takes on c5. Queen to e2. Black to move. Bettinger played bishop takes on c5. He was waiting for this position. Why? What is the best move for black? Please pause again and find the best move for black. Bettinger captured the knight on g3. Pony spinned. b4. Another critical position. How would you continue now? Please pause the video again and find the best move for black. What did you find? Did you find queen to f4? This is the move that Bettinger played. Better was rook takes on h3, threatening checkmate. To save the game, Alechin would have to play bishop to e5, attacking the queen, controlling h2. After queen to g5, pawn takes bishop, knight from b to d7. Position is complex, but five was black. Well, even bishop takes on f2. Check was better than queen to f4. Pawn takes bishop. Material is equal, but black lost the initiative. The knight is under attack. Knight to a4, attacking the bishop. Defending and attacking. Attacking the queen. Queen to d2. Intending to exchange queens and to bring rook to the second rank. Queen takes queen. Rook takes queen. Material is equal. Who is better? Positionally. White is much, much better. Why? Am I wrong? White played a move and black resigned. The move is C6. Bettinger resigned. If pawn takes pawn, bishop takes on c6 check, king to e7, bishop takes on a4, winning a piece. And if b6, one line goes like this. You can find a better line or even a worse line if you wish. But this is just one line. Rook takes rook. Rook takes rook. Knight to c5. c7. King to e7, bishop to d6 check, king to d7, bishop takes knight, king takes pawn, bishop to d6 check. And white is a piece up in a better position, and we can stop here. Bettinger's friends ask him how did he go against Lehin. He said he nearly won. They said to him, keep dreaming. Nobody believed him. Not even his own cat. But there was someone who believed him. That was his dog. That is why they say the dog is man's best friend. By the way, I believed him too. Do you believe that he could have won? What do you think of this game? And that is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your chess. And bye for now.